Okay, and now we are going to deliver several awards. So we start with our oh, this year, research track awards. So this is us, and yeah, we start. Please, Marie. Okay, so we had nominations for distinguished reviewers this year from both the area chairs and from all their colleagues of, on the PC. And we have, we are going to recognize 23 people here who were re, uh, distinguished reviewers for the timeliness, their depth, and their constructiveness in, in providing feedback and lots of active participation in the discussion. So we are going to ask them to come up for a group picture and to, to find their award in the pile. <laughs> <laughs> they are alphabetical by last name while, while I um, uh, say their names. So please hold applause till the very end. So we have Amjad Tahir. So please just, if you're here, come on up. We'll do a group picture. Um, we have Andreas Vogelsong, and Andres Wasalski, Audris Makas, Bogdan Vasilla, Vasil Vasilikas. I'm terrible with names here. I should have practiced these. Brittany Johnson, Kately Sadowski, Christine Julian. Come on up, and you can kind of show them where, where the award is. Demetrius um, Smell, Spinellis, Igor Steinmacher, Jennifer Horkoff, Julia Lawal, Kevin Moran, Kla, this one's really hard, Tantithanthavorn, Klaus Jean Stoll, Leandro Minko, uh, Leonardo Mariani, Marcel Beam, Philip. Leitner, Rachel Tsuref Brill, Sebastian Baltes, Sebastian Broke, and Xavier Franck. So we really appreciate all of you and your efforts. Okay, there we go. So, uh, next step is uh, Distinguished Paper Awards. So this is six of Distinguished Paper Awards, six of awards, less than 10% of the uh, technical papers accepted, uh, yeah, the papers accepted in technical track. And uh, we did our selection based on nominations, but also scores, and but we, we also checked that uh, papers had no major weaknesses. So based on uh, this, we decided to uh, award 10 papers out of uh, 207 accepted papers. So we go one by one. The first one oh. is, uh, do I belong modeling sense of virtual community among Linux kernel contributors? So, yeah. We have uh, only one platform now, but uh, uh, by the end of the conference, you can. Uh, oh, they're come all up. up here and they're yeah. all ordered. They are in the right <laughs> order, so you can just take, uh, pick. No, 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 they're all right here on this table. They are here. Oh, they are there. <laughs> <laughs> we made this one easy. More copy for everybody. The other copy by the yes. Yeah. The next paper is um, compatible remediation on vulnerabilities from third-party libraries for Java projects. 
Please, all the authors, come on up. And it should be the one on the top. Yes. We have to get them to run up. And next one is still around. Uh, experiences for and survival strategy of veteran oh, women. Oh, sorry. A qualitative study on the implementation of design decision of developers, please. And the next one is still around, Experiences and Survival Strategies of Veteran Women Software Developers. Okay, next one is understanding and detecting on the fly configuration bugs. The next one is testing database engines via query plan guidance. Next one is Sibyl improving software engineering tools with SMT selection. The next one is LegiCon, a lightweight and efficient approach to Java confidential computing on SGS, SGX. This is really uh, a commendable paper. This paper got all fives in the reviews. <laughs> Uh, next one is efficiency matters speeding up automated testing with GUI rendering inference. Thank you. 
Congratulations. And the last one is, I'm not sure how to say that, Ret Retta? Retta. Retta, learning namespace representation for program repair. Okay, now we would like to call on the stage Ashina and Alexander for the Software Engineering Society Awards. Hello, everybody. I am Ashina. And I'm Alexander. And we're very pleased to present the awards for the Software Engineering in Society track, beginning with the Best Paper Award, which goes to... Tanjila Kanji, Misita Anwar, Gillian Oliver, and Mohammed Khalid Hussein for their wonderful paper, Developing Software for Diverse Socioeconomic End Users, Lessons Learned from a Case Study of Fisher Folk Communities in Bangladesh. Distinguished Reviewer Awards to give away for our amazing reviewers. And the first one is? For, goes to Igor Wiese. Well, you see them all, but you can come one at a time. Is Igor here? Probably not. All right, so we move on to the next one. Your namesake? The na yes, exactly. Alexander Nolte from Tartu, Estonia. They're all probably very busy reviewing. <laughs> um, the last one, if we have any luck. Ronnie de Souza Santos, the University of Cap Breton, Canada. <laughs> Okay, so we go to the software engineering education and training. Uh, and I would like to call uh, Sonia and uh, Jenga here. Hi, everybody. Uh, um, good morning. <laughs> uh, I'm Sonia Tjangi. Uh, we were honored to chair the software engineering education and training track, and um, even more honored to see all the high quality papers that were submitted. And in the end, we have a best paper award for the track, which was selected from the 32 uh, papers that were uh, accepted. And to select the paper, we looked at uh, nominations from the PC. Um, the scores of the paper, and uh, we also um, looked at the papers ourselves. So we are very pleased to uh, announce the award for you. Go. So the um, best paper goes to Sarah Nurlian, Anna Rafferty, and Elian Weiss for the paper, oops, we technology, yes. Okay. Um, <laughs> understanding students' knowledge of programming patterns through code editing and revising tasks.
Now, unfortunately, none of the authors could make it to Melbourne, so the presentation was virtual. Hopefully, they can come to one of the next ICSIs, but we will make sure they will receive that through good old snail mail. <laughs> Okay, uh, next one is Software Engineering Education in Pratic. Uh, the chair are Anna Liu and Harry Muccini, and uh, I would like to call Harry, but also uh, IPEC, we, which is the uh, IEEE Software Editor-in-Chief, because this award is uh, uh, sponsored by IEEE Software. Ipekoskaya Carnegie Mellon University Software Engineering Institute. Uh, I just want to say a couple words why we sponsored this award about five years ago. Uh, as you know, IEEE Software Magazine exists to bring practice and theory together to remind us all that all the research we do is in pushing for pushing practice forward, and practice should inform research. Maybe one day we won't have separate tracks. Even if we have separate tracks, they're all for the one goal and the same goal. Hello, everybody. This is Andrew Muccini, University of L'Aquila. And uh, I think that we are very, very proud of this award for many reasons. And I think that award-winning author shall be also very proud of it. Uh, we had 146 submissions. At the end, we had uh, 41 papers selected and five industry challenge. But I think more relevant than this, uh, we had an incredible number of 763 co-authors on those submitted papers, okay? And then we have the winner, which is a single author, which is even more, you know, uh, for us was re even more uh, really enthusiastic to nominate. And the award goes to Reinhard Van Tonder uh, for the paper on You Don't Know Search, Helping Users Find Code by Automatically Evaluating Alternative Queries. Okay, now we move to the uh, ACM Student Research Competition at TICSI, and I would like to call Munera and uh, Ling Zhao. In this case, uh, they don't have a, a physical certificate to present because uh, ACM will uh, deliver to the others, but they will, are going to introduce the winners. Yeah. Good morning, everyone. I'm Ling Xiao. So um, I'm from a Singapore Management University. Oh, this one. Okay, sure. Thank you. So I'm very happy to announce the winner for the ACM Student Research Competition. Maybe you know already, ACM Research Competition for students, for both of undergrad students and uh, graduate students already. They have to present original research, not just some published results. They have to do a novel, uh, uh, very impactful research, and do a very good presentation to a panel of judges, including me and uh, Mira from uh, CIS CSRO uh, at the data 61. So we already, together with 30 plus uh, judges, uh, PC members, going through the abstract presentation and also the poster presentation and the final slides presentations. So it's a big challenge for the students. So I would be happy to announce three winners for the, all the, uh, uh, the competitions. So for the undergraduate categories, we select the top one winners. So the winner is from Rice University on a very interesting study on the rep representation of women contributors in the open source communities, including the distribution and the disengagement of women, how we can encourage the women to contribute to the open source communities. Uh, if you are here, maybe you can come to on the stage. We will take a group uh, photo together with all the winners. 
So as I mentioned by Max, ASM will distribute the medal and the monetary awards to the winner recipients by all the snail mails. Okay. For Okay, understand. I think she mentioned that to me already. Okay, thanks. So for the graduate categories, we have two winners. The first winner goes to Chen Jie Liu from a similar research laboratory and the University of Oslo. He did a very interesting work on test scenario generation for auto autonomous driving systems using reinforcement learnings. Congratulations. If you are here, please come on stage. We will take a group photo together. So the second winner goes to Wen Jie Deng from East China Normal University. It's a very interesting work on feedback-driven test generation framework for hardware model checkers. Congratulations to all the winners. If you are here, please come stage. We can take a group photo together. Okay, only this. Okay, uh, so uh, last one, last award is a score. So the uh, chairs are actually, yeah, there is one missing name. So it's Oscar, Luis, but also Mattia Fazzini, which is here. And, 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 and oh, Sean, oh, yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Hello, everyone, good morning. And uh, we are the score co chair. And uh, my name is Mattia Fazzini from University of Minnesota. Oscar Chaparro from the College of William and Mary. Luis Cruz from TU Delft. Xiaoning Du from Monash University. And uh, this year we had a very strong uh, score competition. And the score competition is about creating a software engineering project. And we had four finalists. So what we would like to do is to recognize all the finalists now. So please come on stage. Uh, Private Tap, Code Defenders, PDF, and DSEC. And then we will announce the winner. So. We have certificates for, yeah, great, Oscar. for all finalists, and then we'll give the certificate to the winner. And the winner of this year's core competition is? Hit the green button. Green button. Okay. <laughs> Good. DSEC, a data analyzer tool for ensuring software development and life cycle. Okay, this concludes the award session. Uh, they are going to print more copies of the award certificates and uh, the other uh, winners can uh, pick them up during the closing. Onwards for the day. <laughs> Whose phone is this? Someone, oh. someone left a phone. Somebody left the phone here. Yeah.